Rated M for Mature. Headstrong uh, is making a name for itself as an, as an action studio. Headstrong basically works on a best, best man for the job. We have titles, we have job roles, and every company does. Um, but to be fair, the right person doing the right job is, is much more important for us. One of the key guys that did all the dialogue, did all the script, is in fact a level builder. But he hit the spot for this game. He wanted to do the dialogue, he gave us his first try at it really early on. And he nailed it, he absolutely nailed it. So he's been allowed to run with the script and run with the dialogue and run with the cutscenes from day one. I'm worried now, I'm worried that the game's gonna reveal too much about my character or some sort of dark inner quality. Tell me that was you screaming like a schoolgirl. I've got a really great team, so I'm more than happy to pass everything off because I know they'll do a really good job of it. If you hire guys who basically are the creatives and they want to make the best game they can, you always rein them in, you always have to. I mean, the trick's been reining the producer in. He's been so pepped over this as well that uh, he's, he's gone past his normal, we can't do that, to, yeah, just let's make it. Headstrong, I think, are a perfect fit for House of the Dead in that we've got very creative people. Guess that makes me a doctor. I've worked with most of the people on this project for, for about two years now. I think we just know each other really well. We've got a really good team put together on this one. None of us had really worked together before we, we got onto this, onto this job. This is my first one. Uh, <laughs> I hope that doesn't show. <laughs> We've been through it together and it's really bonded the team together and we're all very, very close. I can't comment on that. And I think also one of our designers has got their dismembered head in their level as well. Yeah, it's certainly been a lot of fun. You know, everyone loves a bit of, well, I like a bit of gore, a bit of, um, you know, death and backward somersaults and people flying through windows and civilians getting eaten. It's, yeah, it's good fun. <laughs> The you are. We have a very good working relationship with Nintendo. We've got great tech, we've made some really good Wii games before. We were one of the first developers to get our hands on the Wii. And I just think that we kind of know what we're doing in that space. We are doing things right now on the Wii that people didn't think could be done on the Wii. We want to push the boundaries a little bit, we want to do something new and interesting. We don't want to follow the formula of this is how you make a light gun game. Yeah, we've been given free reign and as far as I know, none of it has been sort of none of it's come back yet which is quite interesting because we've got all sorts of totally wrong things in it that I won't even begin to talk about now but play the game there you go. It hurts so much. I can help ease the pain.